because we can't transport our fish to Congo, just for one simple reason, that we have got a very prominent minister in Uganda in charge of fisheries department who have sweared that we Kenyans, we are not allowed to transport our fish from Kenya to DRC Congo. She's the only person. It is not URA. It is not any other agencies. We are talking of tonnages. We, take, we have said it is over 200 tons, which is stuck in Kenya. Instead of causing commotion, instead of causing understanding between the two countries, let them set the Kenyan people do their business freely without interference from the Ugandan authority. Because we are taking our fish in, in, in Congo, we wanted just to use their road. But now the people who mishandled us, the people who stole our fish and sold fish worth 60 million Kenyan money, are the ones who had come in Kenya to clear their fish and they have been arrested by Kenyan authority. Uh, this is an unanswered barrier. As traders, we are feeling bad because we are, we are just brother and sisters in East Africa. But Uganda doesn't follow the regulations and rules of East Africa. Actually, there is a pillar, five pillar of movement. Free movement of people, free movement of goods, free movement of labor. We are appealing to His Excellency M7 to intervene and resolve this matter once and for all.